Welcome back everyone to another episode of Shea TV. My name is Marissa Hill and shout out to the New Balance family for sending these my way. Super excited to unbox the Fuel Cell Propel V4s and this is in the black and white colorway. Let's take a quick sneak peek. to another unboxing and review if you're joining us for the first time welcome in today we'll be discussing the fuel cell propel v4 and this is one of my favorite new balance sneakers just because it's so budget friendly so we'll go through the overview of these jump into size and fit followed by how i styled them and we'll conclude with how much these are going for on the retail market so definitely a really cool technology savvy sneaker this has nitrogen infused foam that basically turns into responsive cushioning so really cool technology that's built inside of these and it's basically a pretty highly durable sneaker and it's cushioned for some good distance as far as like a trainer goes so if you're looking for just a good sneaker to walk around in something again that is more reasonably priced this is a good all-around sneaker especially for somebody who wants a solid black and white shoe this is something at least for myself like I've always just needed to have a solid black and white colored sneaker in my collection just because it's something that's very wearable and you know just easy to throw on and have as a sneaker that just fits everything in my wardrobe and it's also just good for you know fast paced instances so if you're somebody who walks pretty fast like myself in the city you're trying to get from point a to point b quickly again this is an amazing trainer for that it's got a stabilized tpu plate under the midsole it's a little less snappy than like a carbon fiber plate but again carbon fiber plates a little bit more on the pricier end than the TPU plate would be uh, so you know still great technology just not as good as that carbon um, fiber plate and that will basically you know help you propel forward but also you know it's a great everyday once again sneaker that is something you can really just transition into your daily schedule um, as far as the upper goes, this is a no sew upper. So that is nice because it's going to reduce irritation that you might have on your foot. And um, again, it's not as great as some of the premium high tiered sneakers from New Balance, but again, just a good all around everyday sneaker for a great price point. All right, so as far as the color scheme goes, we've got just a nice kind of swirled look on the toe box here. It's black and then we've got some metallic uh, colors going on, which is really cool when it hits the light. So it's not just an all over solid black sneaker, which is something that makes it a little bit more fashionable in my opinion. And we've got that same color scheme going up the tongue and then New Balance and the Propel Fuel Cell is in a nice light heather gray. And then it has some nice simple black laces on there and a nice matte black tone for the eyelets. All right, so let's take a look at those details and then move along to the side paneling. around to the side panels we still have that same texture and look and then on the back of the heel we've got new balance outlined in silver as we wrap around to the lateral side that's where we're getting the large new balance n which again is in that silver colorway with a little baby n underneath the interior is in silver and black and then as we work our way to the midsole we've got black and a matte finish with fuel cell on the top here and then underneath a light heather gray and some nice white underneath 
like that. The sneakers then completed with a white, gray, and black outsole. All right, let's take a look at those last and final details. size and fit goes i stuck true size on this one so if you have high arch narrow feet like myself definitely stick true size if you do have flatter wider feet that could differentiate sizing from my own just because we have different types of feet so take that into consideration when deciding on what size you're going to work best for you all right so now let's talk about how i style this really easy to tell color scheme for the first look i decided to wear a just nice simple off the shoulder or one shoulder dress in black i think all black is just a great color scheme that's going to work amazingly with this. For the second look, I decided to wear a black and white striped long sleeve blouse, and I paired that with a nice mini denim skirt. Definitely feel like you can dress these up as well. And then for the last and final look, I wore a black denim pair of pants and I wore a white tank and layered that with a black cropped bomber coat. goes again this is a very affordable sneaker it's $110 so again if you're looking for something that's just a great color combination but also just a really comfortable everyday sneaker to wear this is something that you've got to try out all right everyone that is it for this unboxing and review if you joined us for the first time thank you so much my name is Marissa Hill this is Shay TV we'll catch you all next episode Let it go, Jason.